Hey everyone, it's Simplicity and welcome back to a new video. Today we have a completely new game and we're going to be taking part of Sticky Business, which is a game that just recently came out in mid-July, I believe. Um, it's about literally making your own sticker business and like packaging things up and like creating your own stickers. And I was actually sent a key to this game by Assemble Entertainment. So thank you to the company for providing me with a free key to the game. But yeah, it's gonna be a lot of fun. So we're gonna go ahead and start a new game. Um, my name is Lisa. I have to come up with a shop name. Uh, let's do Simply Stickers. I think that's kind of cute. It ties into like the simplicity thing. And we'll keep it on normal mode so we can see what it's like. This is so exciting. Having your own sticker shop is a dream come true. Let me show you around. Okay. Move to the creative corner and design a sticker to put it in your shop. Alright, we can do that. Um, okay. So, we have a bunch of different options here. I'm just going to click through and take a look. And just see what is available. Um, but yeah, so... I will have a link for this game and download it down in the description, by the way, if you're interested. But it looks like it's going to be really cute. So, I'm trying to think of, like, some ideas. Okay, I think I want to use the frog. I'm just going to place him, like, right here. Alright, I'm going to play around with some controls just to try and figure out what I'm meant to be doing. Um, so I can, like, rotate him and flip him around. But I think we're going to leave him, and then I want to add... Where was it? I had an idea. Um, okay. I have a couple of ideas. So I'm thinking we can add this little kind of like plant on top of him. You can also resize things in this game. So now he looks like a little foggy kind of like strawberry, which is kind of cute. But I think I'm going to make this smaller. It just feels like it's way too big. So we'll just kind of resize, try and place this down where it actually looks like it's attached to his head and then we can take this kind of like little planter and we can just kind of like tuck him into it so it can be like a little foggy planter look at how cute are you kidding um okay so i want to make sure like that everything's like actually in front um i think that looks like it's more attached look at how cute are you kidding okay i'm not mad at it and there is this here, which I think is the border, yeah. So I can make that bigger or smaller, which I actually am going to make it just a little smaller, just to kind of outline him a little bit more. And we're going to keep it white. I think it looks better white, because I don't like it with it off. So I'll keep it like that. And then click on Create, I think. Or do I want to switch this up? Um, I'm, I don't know what I want to do. Now I think we're going to roll with this. This can be our first little sticker. And we have to name it. You, you can save your sticker to share it to your desktop and share it with the world. Okay, I'm just going to call it a floggy plant for right now. And then save. The clock over here will show you how much time you have left today. Creating stickers, printing, packing, and sending will take time. Always keep an eye on it. Um, how Now that your sticker is ready, go to sleep, see if you can get some orders. Okay. That's fine. So I guess that's the end of day one. And exciting news, you've received your first order. We need to arrange them on a sticker sheet and get them ready for printing. Take your time to arrange them. Make sure they fit just right on the sheet. Okay. So again, we only have white paper as an option, which is perfectly fine. Drag and drop onto the sheet or simply click them. They will automatically find a place on the sheet. Alright, well I'm going to just like click and drag them, I think. Just to see how many I can get if I space it out on my own instead of like automatically placing them. But the automatic placement's kind of cool if you don't want to sit here and have to like try and plan this out all on your own. So maybe we'll, we will try that at some point to see how many it can fit based on just clicking on it instead of me sitting here and doing it and seeing which one's like a better deal. So I know that one in here is not lined up. Okay, but like, I really like this so far. I feel like it's a lot of fun, even though we're barely into the game. I have watched some streamers play it, which was why 
I initially had requested a key and I am just, I'm so incredibly grateful that I was approved for this. And I feel like this is one of those games that you could sit here and you could play. Like if you're having like a anxiety night and you just want something to like focus on and not have to think. I feel like this is one of those games. So I guess we'll see, but like that's just kind of the vibe that I get from it. So we're just going to go ahead and finish placing all of these down right here. Okay. We, it's not centered, so I'm going to move these over because it's kind of bothering me just a little bit. Just because there's such a big space on like this side. And this is clearly showing how much of a perfectionist I actually am. But I don't mind. I feel like if I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it right here. And we'll just see what we can get up to. I also don't know how long of a video this is going to be. So, highly recommend going to get a snack or a drink and just kind of like hanging out for a little bit. But I'm excited. I'm, I haven't bought like a new game to the channel in a while, but I feel like this is going to be one of those games that I just adore and I feel like it makes sense to have on the channel because it's like cozy. So, and just kind of, I don't know, I love little like simulation games like this. So we shall see, but I think that's okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and save and see how this goes. Um, so we get 24 stickers out of that printing for 10 coins. All right, so we'll go ahead and just print that. That's a cute little animation. Okay, that's not bad. So I'm gonna have like a couple of them just because I don't know a whole lot with the orders. And now that your sticker's printed, it's time to package. Hey Lisa, it's me and Julia Klein. You have a sticker shop that's amazing. When we meet up next time, you must absolutely tell me all about it. So it looks like she has ordered 15 of the little foggy stickers, but you can customize it with the paper and the filling, which I think is cute. And, um, okay, so we have to place 15 of our little frogs up here into this box. Okay, and I'm gonna try and make this as, like, aesthetically pleasing as I possibly can with how I lay out the stickers. Hopefully this goes okay that I can lay them all out, but we shall see how this goes. Oh, I feel like they're not gonna have enough space for me to do them, like, three rows, like I was hoping they would. Okay, we may have some overlapping stickers, but I like this so they can have, like, little messages and stuff like that okay actually i guess it's not that bad it's touching the edge but like there's no space but it's okay all right so we're done so now we go ahead and hit the pack button and what i like better i like the yellow paper but i don't love the filling colors with it you packed all your orders let's go back and bring them to the post office okay so i do that by clicking here and it automatically sends uh, beginning of your own small business, but go ahead and create the stickers drop of your dreams. Alright, so you can go in here and you can see all like the messages that you have. We have a bunch of customers that we haven't met yet. But we can go ahead and hop back into the creator and make another sticker since we are very early on in the day. I don't know what I want to do. I kind of like the animal stickers. I feel like they're kind of fun. So... I'm going to take the donut. Um, okay, so I'm like trying to see how I can size this. And I'm thinking I can stick the dog's head through the middle of it. Kind of like that. But, okay, that's too small, I feel like. So we might have to size this up, size this up, and put that here. That's kind of cute. I like that you can just have like free creativity with this and there's nothing that you have to like think about. I am not creative when it comes to naming stickers. So this is just going to be a dog donut and that's it. All right. Um, do I want to create another sticker right now? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. 
I feel like we might be able to be okay with just two for right now. But I also kind of want to use this book and the cat and have like the cat like asleep on top of a book. Kind of like that. That's kind of cute. Um, and then I could do like words over the top of it. Maybe. I feel like the words definitely don't really go with this whole kind of like aesthetic of this sticker. So maybe we won't use that for this one. And I also wouldn't know how I would want to attach it. So I think, oh, okay. I like that you can change like the text colors. That's kind of cool. Um, I don't know what else I want to add if I want to add anything else to like a sticker like this. I think we're good. Oh, you don't have enough time to create another sticker. Well, that kind of sucks. So, okay, what is this? Welcome to your item shop. List of stickers can be ordered by customers. The price of each sticker is automatically assigned. Five slots available. Don't worry if you run out of space, you can purchase additional slots. Okay. So Froggy stickers with two, the dog donuts with four. Ooh, I can customize. Um, I like the purple one. And then, what do I want? I like the hearts, that's kind of cute. Okay, we'll stick with that for right now. And go ahead and get some sleep. Okay, so it looks like you actually get some star ratings for stickers. From like experience points, which is kind of cool. And we're gonna hop over here. Oh, it saves. That's I like that. I like that it saves. Um, we'll just go like sleepy cat. I don't know. Very creative with my names. Um, okay, so Julian wants 11 of the frogs. So we can do that really quickly. And we'll just go ahead and place these right in here. I like that I get to like experience a new game with all of you and just like sit here and chill. Like I am so incredibly relaxed right now with playing this. Okay. Um, we need three more. Okay. See, this would have been very aesthetically pleasing if they didn't have like a random one. All right, pack. Oh, there's like candy and stuff you can add to at some point. That's kind of cool. And, oh, I haven't printed off any of the dogs. Um, we'll come in here and make a new sticker sheet and stick with white paper. Okay, let's just go ahead and place all of these on here. This is going to be not as many stickers by the looks of it because... They are a little bit bigger, and it could also just be me trying to space them out. Because I'm trying to think, like, realistically, like, if you're printing on, like, sticker paper, you're going to want to have space around it that you're able to, like, cut the stickers out properly, you know what I mean? So, yeah, that's not as many, but that's okay. We get 15 out of it, and they weren't completely even, but it's okay. So we can at least head back over here to the packing and um, we'll do something like this. Place our little frog plants in here. Okay. If you guys ha end up having any ideas of like certain things you think could look cute with stickers, because I have a feeling I'm probably going to play this again with all of you, let me know. Because I'm totally up for some creative suggestions. Or, like, things that you think would look cute. Or, like, what you would order if you were ordering from the sticker shop. Okay, packing is done. So now we can go to the post office. Click right here and away they go. Alright. Um. Oh. Okay, so I was curious what the upgrades were. So it looks like you can come in here and buy different sticker elements. Look at the little red panda. Um, the axolotl face is also cute. The sloth face. Okay, I'm also quickly going to make a sticker sheet of the cats, which I didn't realize these were as tiny as they are. I thought I made them fairly 
big on them, but maybe I didn't. So you have to kind of also pay attention to the potential turnover. Um, because if you are having a smaller turnover rate than the printing costs, you're probably going to lose money, I would think. So we're just going to sit here and put a bunch of these little stickers on this page. My spacing is not perfect, but it's okay. This is the very first time that I've played this game anyways. So not everything is going to be perfect. There's always room for improvement. And we can just see what we can get up to. But I don't know. I feel like this is just one of those games that I'm going to love. And hopefully all of you love watching as well. Because I like having a little bit of variety. Because I know like I've been posting some other, like a lot of like Animal Crossing and stuff lately. But it's nice to have a game like this. That I can just like sit and relax but also still be making content and showing you games that I enjoy. And even though this is technically my first impression of uh, playing it myself, I've watched people with like Twitch also on Twitch. Um, they have a integration where like your chat can make orders which I think is super cute. So it is very interactive. If anybody is looking for a new game to stream that you want like chat to be able to participate in, this is one of them. So I just bought some stickers and I'm so excited to get them. I hope they're not too big. I have to hide them from my sister Alex. She snatches everything I buy for myself and tries to copy me. I don't have a sibling so I don't know what that's like. But we're just going to go ahead and place some of these little dog donuts. Hopefully they're not too big for this customer. But... We'll just place these in here. I don't know. Like, if I was doing, like, a sticker order, I feel like I'd have to be, like, very... I don't know what the word is. Like, I wouldn't want nine of, like, the same sticker. I don't know. Um, I need to print, sorry. And then I'll get back to reading what I was doing then. But let me print off a few more things. Okay. Just so I have them. Um, so anyways, while we package this, looking at your cute plant stickers really cheered me up. You know, right now, every, uh, you know, right now everything seems kind of bad. I truly needed this. Thank you. Okay, well now the game's gonna make me melt. Like, I feel like if I was to actually ever run my own business, which I guess technically YouTube kind of is like a business, and I know, like, comments about like me making people's day but it was really sweet but I feel like running a business like this or like any sort of business in general and receiving something like that is just shows that whatever you are doing is worth it so we'll just keep going here oh dang it okay there's gonna be one extra sticker that ruins my little like symmetry moment no Okay, pack it up. I was looking for animal stickers and want to give them to a friend who is not feeling really well at the moment. I think these stickers might cheer them up. Okay. Um, I need to come down here and print off another page or two of some cat stickers. And at least printing is fairly easy. But I wasn't expecting somebody to want 36 cat stickers. So that was kind of a lot. But we'll just go ahead and place all of these in here. But these messages are very cute. So we've met a t few different customers now today. Um, Alright. I'm just going to kind of package these up as best as I can. And we might be able to fit 20 of these in a row. I think. Alright. Let's just keep placing these. So yeah, we can do 20. So I'm going to just kind of, this is probably not going to make a lot of sense, but I'm going to try and lay them over the top of each other just for the sake of the symmetry instead of it being kind of a little bit more, yeah, that one didn't line up. Okay, I'm just going to start placing them. The placement doesn't really matter all too much, so we'll just place them in here as long as they are in the box. So that's what matters. And then we get to add one little froggy plant and not have it be a box just full of cats. So, 
Okay, so there's that. And then we'll place the little froggy right here. Pack it up and away we go. Um, okay, so this one doesn't have a note. But this one is Julian. And they requested nine frogs and two cats. Which we can definitely do. We at least have enough stickers that I don't have to run and print them right now, which is nice. So that's one thing I'm kind of noticing is it's probably a good idea to bulk print if you can, but you also have to kind of pay attention to the money. So there we are, let's pack that up. And then we have George who wants two frogs and four dogs. So there's your two frogs and then one two, three, four. Okay. I think that's it. No, we have one more. We have 16 cats for Luca. So we'll just go ahead. I kind of like the pop of green with it and with like the more cream colored paper. I don't know why. I just kind of like it's got like a little bit of a contrast. So let's go ahead and see how many of these I can just kind of like fit in here but it seems to be going fairly well there's like a really weird sound going on right now i don't know what it is so hopefully you can't hear it but if there is i'll just have to like edit that out but okay so we've packed all of our orders for the day we can send them off to the post office and then get some sleep actually um yeah we'll just go ahead and get some sleep so we sent out six today and here comes our experience points, which is what the little hearts are. Okay. I love seeing this just kind of like rack up a little bit. We can also see how many stickers we printed today. And there comes our money, which is always nice to see. So that is the end of day four. I'm going to go ahead and do a few more days. I feel like, I don't know, I'm just having a lot of fun with it. So... We have three orders today, it looks like. Um, quickly, I just want to make sure that I have enough stickers. So let me just kind of print off a few different pages. Okay. These little animations are so cute. But I also have to make sure that I'm paying attention to the little clock down in the corner. Alright, I think that should be okay. So we'll hop in here. Okay, so George wants five frogs, three cats, and a dog. All right, um, that shouldn't be too bad. Apparently George doesn't want to talk. He just likes to order stickers every day, but that's not too bad, those five. And then we'll put three little cats in here as well. And then we'll do a little dog over here in the corner and we can pack that one up. And Theodore wants five dogs. So that should be pretty easy. I can actually put these in like a pattern. So if I go like this and then like this and like this kind of like a dice. All right. And then Owen wants four dogs. These are very easy orders today. One, two, three. See, this is when it'd be good to have like a candy that I could just like stick right in the middle. So I'm going to give them a little bonus one and put a frog in here instead. Uh, you've packed all of your orders. Okay. We'll send those off. And we might have time to actually hop back into the creator mode, maybe. Okay, so we can see everything. So the sleepy cat only sells for one coin. Don't have enough time to create another sticker. Um, Alright, I don't really need to make any more sticker sheets right now. So we can also click in here and see all of our past messages. Music is important for my students. So do I have to make like a music theme sticker to unlock that one? Is that kind of what that hint is? But I think we're going to go to sleep for the night. All right, so we sent out three today. We can get our little experience points here. Okay. Cute. That's the end of day five. So it looks like we have four orders today for day six. I'm gonna hop into the creator mode really quick though, because I think it would be cute to add one more sticker just so we have an even amount. But I don't know what I want to do. 
I think I want to use this little bunny. I don't know what it is. I really like the little, like, plant-themed stickers. And then we could do this sized up like it's peeking kind of, like, over a bit of taller glass, maybe. Okay. So, like, I'm trying to, like, make this size look okay. And maybe we could, like, size this down to look like you have a little flower on you. Um... Or I could do like a flower in the glass. And I don't know what I'm just kind of like guessing what I want to do here. Um, I don't know if I want to use that one. But we'll put this. I wish there was an in-between size, but we'll put that like right there, maybe. And what else do we have? Um I don't know. I feel like that's actually not that bad. I feel like it's still kind of cute. But we could maybe do something like this. I'm just trying to break it up and like use different elements. So we'll put this like here. And then this can be like a little plant tail maybe. If I can lay it in behind properly. Okay. I feel like that's not that bad. It kind of looks like a little plant tail, but it also looks like a plant just kind of like coming up out of the glass, but I think it's cute. Um, I don't have a name for it though. Um, apparently that's what we're doing is just like animal plant. So those that I'm not going to make a sticker sheet for them. I'm going to hop over here to packing. I saw some awesome stickers my sister on my sister Hannah's cell phone and needed them for myself. I sneaked into a room and found your shop name. Okay. That's kind of cute. So we'll just go ahead and place some of these little dog stickers in here for Alex. Okay. I need to like space these properly. I feel like the way that I space them, they get very like bunched up. So, if I do this like this, maybe? Yeah, my spacing's not perfect, but that's okay. It gives us space that we can have these kind of even. And then we can place a little cat right there and pack it up. Alright, so Sarah wants five dog stickers and twelve of the frogs. So I'm going to do the dog first. Just because they take up more space and then I can know how I should be placing the frog stickers. And then we'll just see if we can fit 12. I don't think we're going to be able to fit these perfectly. But we'll just try and kind of squish them all in here the best that we can. And I'm going to have to overlap a little bit but I feel like that's okay. As long as you can kind of like see that there's enough stickers. I think we should be all right. All right, one more. There we are, we'll pack that up. Okay, so Waylon wants two frogs, a cat, and three dogs. So we'll just, this is an easy one. Um, okay, one, two, three, and then a cat. And we can pack that lid up and be good to go. Uh, Christian wants three dogs, two frogs, and a cat. So at least we have like some different orders and it's kind of nice. I don't know. I feel like this is very like weirdly relaxing, like not in a bad way. But I just feel like it's probably going to get a little bit more stressful as it continues to grow. We've packed all of the orders for today so we can ship them off. I think that's going to be it for the night. So now I'm going to hop in here and just see what there is in order to like order and see what we have. We have a few little different paces. We've got some pride flags. We've got some more little like text features, some food features. Um, we've got some ice cream. They have an ice cream cone and an ice cream cup that I'm going to get. Okay, so the, some of these cost hearts, which is actually fine. So oh, do they all cost hearts? It looks like they all cost hearts. That's not too bad. We have some more little plants in here. We've got some little mushrooms and toadstools, which is super cute. We have other pots as well. I love this little yellow one. And the turquoise one's also very cute. 
So you can also see the ones that we already have that have stars, which is cool. Um, okay, I'll go ahead and get this too. And maybe a mustache. Um, okay. What are these little options up here? Okay, so like we can buy like paper and like different colors of things. I don't know what these colors are for quite yet. Maybe the paper colors? Well, I guess not because these say paper. Um, okay. I like that there's like different customization options though. But we can also come in here and get like a lollipop or like sour candy, which I think is cool. So we'll just go ahead and buy a few of these like little cotton candy ones. They're fairly cheap, so we'll do that. And then, not enough time for another sticker today. Okay, that's fine. We can go ahead and just print off a few stickers just to wrap up the night before we go ahead and get some sleep. And we'll hop on in for maybe one more day, because I think this is, what, day six? Possibly. Yeah, so we have done six days. So we'll just go ahead and get some of these experience points. So it looks like the experience points are what you need for the hearts, which isn't bad. So we'll hop in here. We have three orders today. So this first one is for the dog stickers. And you can see the little candy options here, which is cute. So I can go ahead and do something like this where the dog stickers are on the outside and then we can take like one of these and just like stick it right there and then pack it um finally a sticker shop of motives that i like well we are completely all animal focused but i don't have a sticker sheet for a bunny so i have to go ahead and do that really quick these are smaller than i thought they were but i guess that means that we can go ahead and fit a fair amount of these on a page at least. So I know I can just like click and they'll find a spot, but I kind of like being able to just like drag and drop them myself. So we'll just go ahead and keep doing that. And then for the next video that I do on this, cause I can definitely see myself playing this fairly often. I feel like we'll go ahead and test that out and just see what the better turnover point is and if it's better to do it yourself or the way that the game intends so i also like that you can like add more than one sticker to your sticker sheets for me i don't know if this is just like the way that i prefer things but i kind of like having one sticker sheet like per sticker i know i could do different things where i could have like multiple stickers all on this like one sheet but I like having it organized. So, okay. We'll just kind of keep doing this. I was making sure that I had enough space for some more different like lines of bunny stickers. So we'll just keep dragging and dropping these onto here. Okay. I don't know how many stickers we have going on, but this one feels like it has the most on it so far. Um, we'll place this one down here. Alright. This is so much fun. I'm seriously enjoying this game so much. Okay, this is like... My brain's very really happy with all of this. Um, we'll put this one here. And... Okay. Sticker sheet is good to go. We have 48 stickers on there. So we've printed them off. We should be okay since we only have a few orders today. Um, alright, we'll put some paper in and some filling. So, we have five frog stickers. I'm gonna do these kind of, like, in order. Six bunny stickers, two, two cat stickers, and one dog. So, I definitely need to branch out just from doing the animal stickers. But for whatever reason, that's the one that I'm enjoying making the most right now. So, we'll just go ahead and place some of these in here. There's the bunny. And then we have two cats and a dog sticker. Okay. There we are. And I'm gonna try and like organize this. I don't think this is going to work the way I wanted it to. I mean, maybe. And then we can go ahead and add a little candy in here too. Like right there and pack it up. 
Okay, so Malachi says that they love the shop and they want four of the dog stickers, which you've all seen how I pack up a sticker of four by now. So we'll go ahead and do this like that and then throw a little candy right there. We can head pack and away we go. Okay, so that's it for today. We can go ahead and send those off. And we're only like halfway through the day, which isn't bad, but I kind of want to go ahead and maybe, oh, I didn't realize I had so little of options for money. Well, I guess we can come in here and like create another sticker. So I guess the ones that we have new light up with a little red dot, but okay. Then I'm going to use a little frog and an ice cream cone. And we're going to place him as like a frog ice cream. Because he is kind of ice cream shaped. I don't, I know I literally just said, oh, I need to get away from the frog, or like the animal stickers. What am I doing? Creating an animal food sticker. Um, I think I like this one more. I feel like it's more proportionate to the size of the frog. And what else do we have? I could give him a little mustache. No. What color options? I feel like he doesn't look good in a mustache. Oh yeah, we're not going to do the mustache. I feel like that doesn't look very good. So we will remove that. And we also have this wing sticker, which I could use in different ways by like rotating it maybe. But what do I want to do? Um, hmm. We can see if like this maybe works. Um, I want to, like, take that to the back. Okay. That was the long button. Like that? I feel like that kind of looks like ice cream. I don't know. Um, even though it's definitely a plant. But okay, so this is just going to be frog ice cream. And we can go ahead and put this onto another little sticker page while we're at it. Okay. So, uh, yeah, these ones are a little bit bigger, which is fine. So, it looks like they're costing six every single time that you place one on, is what I'm basing off of the potential turnover, at least. And if I, like, I know it, I can rotate these, which could actually have been a better way to do this, because I could, like, tuck these, like, up in here. Like, obviously, I can't like that, but I'm just going to stick with the way that I was doing it originally, I know I could get more the other way, but it's okay. For right now, we're just going to stick just like this. All right. So we get 15 that way, which isn't great, but that's okay. So we at least have some more little stickers ready to go. But I think we might actually wrap this up. We filled all five of our slots up here. We've been playing this for almost an hour, so I think this might be a good time to wrap up this video. So you'll have to let me know what you think. I am having so much fun with this. I feel like it's definitely one I can see myself bringing to the channel more regularly. But let's get some sleep. But again, thank you to Assemble Entertainment for sending me a key to this game. Um, if you are new here and you want to see some more videos from me, Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you're already subscribed and want notifications when I post, hit that bell down below. Leaving a like in the comment helps push the video to the algorithm, which would mean a lot to help grow this community. And I typically post four to five times a week, but otherwise I will see you all next time. Bye lovelies.